Moni Gerard, finalist for the New South Wales Women of the Year Awards. Quite an honour for yourself. Yeah, massive honour. Um, really humble about it, but um, knowing that there's other ladies that were up against um, you know, one of the finalists as well, it's pretty humbling just to get noticed pretty much and um, I guess it's a good indication of where netball's going to and hopefully New South Wales netball can keep improving the, the whole community engagement programs that we have. Taria Pitt was announced as the winner of the Premier's Award, which is what you were up for. She's got quite a story. Oh, brilliant story too and I, she's a massive inspiration to the um, majority of the girls that are um, you know, who, who give up quite easily and she's definitely one of those determined ladies uh, regardless of you know the diversity that she's gone through and yeah, she so deserves it and there's a few other ladies that are involved as well that you know, they could, were capable of winning it as well but she's definitely one, one pretty cool chick. Your nomination comes off the back of a lot of behind the scenes work that you do with young people, particularly in leading an active lifestyle in sport. What's next over the next coming months? Yeah, interesting. There's a few things happening. I'm obviously involved with the Swifts with their um, specialist coaching with the defence end and um, I'm also coaching with Sydney Uni and then trying to fit in a rugby training schedule and then also um, you know, doing some work with Matchfield Sports High and there's a couple of programs that I want to start up to within the, um, the eastern suburbs with engaging some of the kids there um, in some leadership programs. So, yeah, there's a few things on the plate but um, keeps me busy, keep me alive and the, and, the, and the kids keep me young too, so it's all right. And Oceana Netball Cup will be back again uh, this year for the third year. Yeah, it's definitely a little puppy that I'm really passionate about and um, Oceania Cup is hopefully will be growing this year. Over the last two years it's definitely stepped up in the participation rate and um, yeah, hopefully we get more, I guess, communities involved and um, different ethnic groups to, the, to try the challenge of playing netball but and having fun at doing it at the same time.